All right, guys. I'm very excited because today is the day we finally get to start a brand new Mario & Luigi game. You guys have no idea how long I've been waiting for this day. I've waited nine years for a new Mario & Luigi game because I played Paper Jam around this time about nine years ago for the very first time. And I remember I was just wanting like a brand new Mario & Luigi for so long and we never got one. But today we finally have a new one, Mario & Luigi Brothership. Now, I did boot the game to make sure it runs, and it looks like it does. There's a little opening cutscene, which is kind of cool. So, uh, let's have a look at it. Yeah, this cute little loading icon, too, with the ship, which I like. I like that. So, when I booted up the first time, it was like, this game is autosave. Yeah. <laughs> yeah! This is the, this is the cutscene they showed in the opening, or like the, the reveal for this game. <laughs> oh no 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 no. Holy shit, it's Mar Mario's jerk off hand is glowing. Well, I guess we know that Mario jacks off with his left hand now. Holy shit, it's Fortnite, Luigi! Oh, Luigi, we've been invited to Fortnite! There's Peach! Peach is like, what the fuck is going on over there? It's making Xbox symbols. Or not Xbox, PlayStation. And here's Bauer. Yo, was that orange Cody that I just see? Like, damn, damn. What the fuck's going on there? Oh god, I'm being flashbanged. Luigi! <laughs> It's literally just the Mario Bros. movie. <laughs> oh, Fortnite's looking a little different, Luigi! Oh, Mario, I don't remember Fortnite looking like this last time I was here. Can't believe Luigi's dead. <laughs> uh damn, I can't believe Luigi got fucking evaporated, bro. Ooh, hold on, let me just let me just sit on this title screen for a sec. Dang, look at that water. That is some damn good looking water, man. And I thought GameCube water looked good. It's very, very tropical sounding. Oh, I guess, I guess that's the whole title song. Well, I do got a video rendering in the background, so hopefully that doesn't mess up too much. Oh! Dumbass, wake up! Oh no! Luigi. 
GG. Damn, this looks nice. Luigi. Luigi. Oh. Kevin Out Guy is definitely getting better in the role of Mario, though, I will say. He's having a lot better. Uh, since he's had a few times to do the performance now. Oh my god, look at this. Uh, this is, this is a dream to control, honestly. We got crabs. Can I, can I jump on the crabs? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. I mean, maybe if you jump on the crabs, they get like a coin or something. Oh my god, I wait, hang on, I just realized. This is like the 3DS games, where you don't technically have 360 movement. But you get like, I think like, it's like 12 to 16 different directions you can move in. Which... It's technically not true 3D, but it, it, it still feels really nice. Yeah, cause I'm moving, I'm moving my stick, and uh, it's not true 3D, but that's okay. Oh shit! Here we got a battle. She's an enemy. What the heck? Alright, so we got the jump, we got items, I can run like a little bitch. Ooh, that feels nice to do. Okay, I mean, I mean the tutorials are forced, but they feel pretty nice. Excellent! One thing I was kind of uh, unsure about on is the um, result screen, because it looks a little basic. But I mean, now that I'm playing it, it's not that bad. It looks decent enough. <laughs> also, one second. Okay, well, I'm getting a bit of a, a bit of tearing on my end, so I might open up my uh, Elgato real quick. So, yeah. Okay, I think I fixed a little bit of the tearing. It doesn't seem as bad now. <laughs> oh. I mean, here's the thing. I'd rather play. I'd rather play with the um. This. What do you call it? The projector because it makes the game look nicer. The game capture HD makes it look all blurry and shit, which I don't like. So, yeah, that's kind of my problem. Honestly, I think it's more of a fault that um, I just have like a really crappy monitor. <laughs> My monitor only like it only refreshes every for 59 hertz, which is really bad. <laughs> oh shit! I can't do anything here. Well, I love the cell shaded look. <laughs> Luigi's fucking dead, bro. <laughs> I wish Luigi didn't die. Luigi. Oh, there he is. Mm -hmm. oh, Mario's having delusions. We probably gotta find- we gotta really gotta go find Luigi somewhere. Luigi. Dang, could you imagine how fucking sad that would be? There's just a Mario game where Luigi fucking dies, and then Mario just starts having delusions about his dead brother thinking that he's there. That'd be like the most messed up freaking Mario game ever. Okay, let's fight these guys.
Kind of, kind of, it's kind of giving me like Cuphead vibes for some reason with the battle music. I don't know why. <laughs> I wonder if there's any way to make my, uh, my monitor a bit less shitty. Okay, I just upped the refresh rate slightly. And, um, it seems to be slightly better, I think. And I also gave OBS a high performance, so that's probably gonna help as well, I think. Nah, it, it still seems shitty, honestly. <laughs> that's gonna bug me, honestly. Alright, let's continue. We're just having fun kind of looking around. <laughs> and I don't think we can push all these boulders yet. Which is a bit of a shame, but whatever. No, I can't get those that block over there. What are these what are these guys anyway? I probably should look at these enemy names. These are, uh, Seedles. They're kind of like our, uh, typical Goombas. Oh, we got the, uh, we got the, the guard. That's cool. Always nice to see the, um... I mean, I'm not too big on the emergency block from... You know, I think it was either Dream Team or Paper Jam onwards, but it's a fun, it's a fun option to have. Mario. Mario. I gotta say that this is some great music. <laughs> Turns out Luigi mm. is just like hiding in one of the bushes and he's gonna jump scare Mario. Mario. Oh, I got a load screen. <laughs> So this is the brothership. Oh hell yeah! Yeah, I love the brotherly reunions in these games. Yeah, Luigi's B, obviously. Everybody knows that. What are the what are these blocks? They're they're hidden blocks. Look how far apart they are though. <laughs> oh, here's the, the lady from the trailers. Oh my god, they frickin' speak like Animal Crossing characters! <laughs> I'm glad you found your brother again. Then are you Mario? Hello, Mario. Nice to meet you, my name's Connie. 
Lee came falling out of the sky so suddenly. It was a real shocker. No pun intended. Actually, yes, pun, the, pun very much intended, actually. He's been very worried about you, Mario. Oh my god, the Italian gibberish! The Italian gibberish is back! What's that? You want to know where you are? I've already told Luigi here, but I'll say it again for you. This is Concordia, a peaceful place. At least it used to be. We're gonna get some war. In the very center of Concordia stood a giant tree known as the Unitree. It held the land together. An energy called Connectar flowed from it to everywhere in the island. Connector. Yeah, it's probably Connector. <laughs> oh my god, that's like two puns in one, jeez. That connector kept everything going and let us live happily, happy lives, happily lives. However, oh no, oh no, the tree was destroyed and Concordia broke apart. So is that what we're doing here? We're gonna like unite the islands back together? It was so strange. The ground broke and became numerous islands drifting apart. So that's the that's why everything is gonna be an island. I passed out. When I woke up, I was here on Ship Shape Island. After that... I planted a Unitree seed right here. Oh. And that's how we have this. This is the new Unitree. It's small, but it's growing. Oh, caring for the Unitree is my job. I'm a Watanist. Oh, oh my, are you fucking kidding? Are you fucking serious? Oh my god, the puns are just- the puns- just don't- don't, don't stop with the puns, please. Please, I- I need more of them, honestly. I'm still new at it. Some good has already come from the tree, though. It's finally grown to the point where it produces connector. That day, the shattered continent became countless drifting islands wandering the ocean currents. If they can link up the Unitree with all the drifting islands, I'm sure the power of Connector will restore the world. Mario and Luigi, you came here from another world, right? Yes! It'd be great if there was a way to get you back home. <laughs> I'll take it from here. Snowlet, I wonder where you were hiding. It's cozy under that hat. The color of a grassy meadow too tugs at a pig's heart, you know? Oh, but let's be clear. I ain't a pig. These aren't nostrils. They're my eyes. So don't let any thoughts of bacon dance in your heads when you look at my way, hey? This little cutie, Snowlet, we're good friends. Snowlet seems to enjoy cozying up inside Luigi's hat. Need a way to get back home? I'll find it for you. But in exchange for that, even though it might seem strange, we've got a request for you too. <laughs> Snowlet's gonna have a fucking accent, I don't care. <laughs> Will you help us re reconnect our drifting islands? First Luigi comes falling out of the sky, then Mario comes hopping over. There's gotta be something to all this. At least that's what I'm thinking. Luigi, Mario, what you say? Work with me and Connie. I don't know what accent it has, but this is what we're going with. Huh? You'll really help us? Oh, yeah. I mean, uh, yeah, thanks for that. That's very reassuring, really, thank you so much. Looks like I'll be showing you around then. I got lots to teach you. Let's get started finding some drifting islands. Come on. Or I could ignore that and just go over here. Dang it, there's rocks in the way. I'm just gonna go exploring. Yay! Safe blocks are back. I missed save blocks, bro. They're not anywhere in, um, Paper Jam. Ooh. Yo, holy shit, you could have five saves? That's way better than the 3DS games, where you only get fucking two saves for some reason. Hey, 
Hey, mushroom, nice. Oh, hey, there's a present down there. It's one of those rare presents. I want that. How do I get that? You know, chances are I probably have to come back here with a hammer and break these blocks. Oh, look at this! Hey, Mario and Luigi, over here! Hey, I'm working on it. Hey, I'm working on it! Okay, I think we got like some ball ability to listen to go in there. So that's gonna have to wait. I mean, I'm exploring. Let me ha let me have fun with my new Mario and Luigi game. Okay, we got a nice view of the ocean. Not sure if this is a 30 or a 60 FPS game, but honestly, I don't really care since it's a new game. My 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 thoughts on like FPS is if the game is a brand new one, if it's 30, I don't mind. But if it's a remake of a game that was originally 60, then I have a problem with it. <laughs> That's kind of my whole uh, shtick, really. Oh, ah, look at that, Luigi! Wow, I, I don't fucking know what this is. <laughs> the brothers are just like... The brothers are just having fun, um... Like, looking around. Oh, hang on a minute. So... From what... Hang on, let me, let me try something. Wait, hang on, Luigi... Luigi auto-jumps. You don't have to press B every time you want Luigi to go up a slope. Oh my god, that's so cool. It really makes, um... I mean, not, not that it's a bad thing, but like, I, I think it makes the game more mindless. But that's like a good thing, because sometimes you just want to like, shut your brain off and then just kind of like, explore without having to worry about managing both bros at the same time. That's probably why Luigi follows behind you like that. And from what looks like, the only buttons that actually do anything right now are A and B. I'll probably be able to open the menu later, but yeah. If you have any questions, I'll answer them if I can. Uh, Concordia? I think I said this already, so sorry for repeating it. Oh, uh, it's just a, it's just a, we're just repeating that? Okay, okay. I was expecting, like, some fluff dialogue. Not, not, uh, repeated lore. <laughs> wow. First things first. You're gonna be spending a bunch of time staring at the map. Let's not even get into all the items you'll be juggling. So, do the thing. What thing? Come on, I gotta spill it out. You gotta do the plus thing right now. Go on, press plus. Wink. Ah, here we go. Okay, so you can see Mario and Luigi's stats, get hints about your adventure. You can prepare for battle in the menus. You were coming back here lost, so get comfortable. When you're done, press plus again and leave. Alright, well, let's look at the settings. You can turn Rumble on or off. Um, I think I have Rumble off anyways, so that probably won't matter. Snoutlet School? Oh. This is where you, um... You know what, let's just let's get a look at, like, let's just... Even though I'm a Mario and Luigi master, I'm gonna look at this anyways. Because it's fun. You can see enemy HP, which, by the way, that yeah, that's new. Enemy HP? That's not been in any other games. When you level up, your stats increase. If both brothers reach zero, they die. Okay, they have the try- they have the try again thing from Dream Team and onwards. I mean, I'm gonna be honest. I, um... Wait. There's two easy modes in this game? Why? <laughs> why are- why do they have two easy modes? the fuck? After getting KO'd by using a mushroom item, when your HP gets low, a bro gets KO'd, use a 1-up. That's, uh, that's normal. Hang on. What, are the, what was that fifth one? 
You're having a hard time winning. It's useful to make Mario Luigi stronger by leveling up or better gear. The brother's strength described in numbers. You can check them on their stats. Oh my god! I, I can barely see it, but your jump and hammer um, power is different, like in Paper Jam. You can jump, yeah, emergency guard, jump counters. We're probably gonna get hammer counters later. Yeah. Okay, cool. We can check our stats. I mean, it's not the, like, craziest, um, stat screen, but it's got style, which I like. Okay, guide on or off. No, no gear? Also, it looks like we can unlock- Oh, they got rank up bonuses, too? Oh, shit. That's a lot of rank bonuses. Wait, how many ranks are it? There's seven ranks. Oh, shit. Wait. Is this exactly like Paper Jam? Is there seven rank up bonuses? Or there's there's seven rank up bonuses and, and uh, seven ranks, right? Where you get like um, an extra rank up at the max rank, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's exactly it. Okay, so it looks like Rainbow Rank is at 43 in this game. I don't remember what level it was. I think it was... Okay, no, hold on. I gotta look this up. Uh, Rainbow... Rainbow Rank. Mario and Luigi. Um, I'm pretty sure in Paper Jam it's... Okay, in Paper Jam it's 46. In this game it's 43. So that, to me, says that this has the second highest level curve in the series, I think. Because in Dream Team, the level cap is... Well, the, the Rainbow Rank's 40 in Dream Team. And it's 40 in uh, Bowser's Insight Story as well. So, hey, that's that's already a great sign that this has the second highest level cap, or level curve, you know what I mean? Because I think, you know, a more epic Mario & Luigi game should end at, like, a good level. Like, you should be at, like, 40s by the time you're at the final boss. So, yeah. Run down boots, thin wear, yeah, that's... That's pretty typical sounding gear, honestly. We got a nut! Nerf! Oh, they got beans! Beans are back, too. And whatever this is... I had my fun. <laughs> also, you can check the, uh... Ooh, oh, dude, look at these frickin' images. These are so cool. Let's see, um... After Mar- wait, okay, so let's see, uh... After traveling through a light vortex, Mario awakens on an unfamiliar isle where our adventure begins. Where has Mario found himself? Explore the isle as you go in search of Luigi. After Mario and Luigi reunite on Ship Shape Island, they join up with Snoutlet to help Concordia. Follow Ship Shape Island with Luigi. Follow Snoutlet's guidance. So yeah, Snoutlet is gonna be our uh, guide for this game, which... It's, it's nice to finally have a new guide. It's refreshing, because we haven't had a new guide, I guess, since Dreambert. Dreambert's been the last new ally. And then I guess, like, you know, you got the other two, you know, guys. You got Stuffwell, you got Starlo. Starlo is in this game, from what I've seen, but I think she's more of, like, Peach's assistant in this game and not Mario and Luigi's. Which, I don't hate Starlo, but, and I don't mind the fact that she's in this game at all. Like, I just think it's refreshing to have a new guide for the bros. Like, Starlo can still be in as long as she's not helping out the bros, you know what I mean? If you ever forget something, how something works when you're on a bench, it checks out at school settings. Also, they got a uh, we got a speed up button. That's always great. Thankfully, they know how to. They know that I, you know, I want to replay this game someday, and that I would love to skip everything. Okay, I got a little more to show you. I, I fucking made this guy like have a New Jersey accent. <laughs> sure, New Jersey accent it is. I mean, it, I mean, honestly, Snowlet sounds more like fucking Don Chan from, uh, you know, Taiko. 
But sure, you know what? New Jersey accent for the irony. Ta da! There's some cannon, eh? Eh? Just the right size to fit a couple of brave folks inside. You see where I'm in with this? How you gonna get to the islands? Oh! Got, got it in one. <laughs> yes, I need more Mario and Luigi gibberish, please. Can't call it a bad idea when it's the only idea. You two are gonna launch yourselves into parts unknown. Ah, oh, fuck. What a load of shit this is, eh, Luigi? Gay Luigi? Yeah, I know, if we had a better way, we'd do that instead, sorry. I'll be going along with you, so there's nothing to worry about. Hey, hey, I see a drifted island. Some coincidence, eh? Well, I won't complain. There's gotta be a lighthouse on that island, so that's where we're headed. Oh? I'll explain the rest as we go. For now, it's time to blast off in the big cannon, eh? Okay, you're, you're, you belong in my hat now. See, Sarlo, Sarlo lives in Luigi, in, er, Sarlo lives in Mario's hat, or not Mario's hat, Mario's pants, <laughs> and, and Snoutlet lives in Luigi's hat. Luigi's finally getting the recognition he needs. Anyways, let's save. Yay! Bro, I've already been playing for 36 minutes, that's how you know I've been having fun. Well, actually, no, that's not true. Most of this was me trying to look at my fucking graphics card settings. The big cannon! When in the big cannon, use left stick to move targeting reticle. Aim at an island, press A. Can I use the gyro aiming too? That'd be neat. Depending on the island, once you're in the air, you won't be able to return to ship shape for a while, so make your preps first. Aw, oh, there's no gyro aiming. That's too bad. So it looks like that's the only island so far. Yeah, I mean, that's cool. Rumbla Island. Luigi, look, we found the Great Island! Oh shit, buddy, that's pretty good. Mm -hmm. oh, oh. Boom. <laughs> oh, that's already great. I love this game already. I only play it for half an hour. We gotta get the tutorial stuff out of the way. That's what, Then the game will get good. <laughs> this game is so expressive, oh, yeah. dude. I love it. Mm, it's a goal. What a nice looking island. Kinda looks like, uh, this is like the first town of the game. Hey, folks. I've had a bunch of outsiders get here. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I'm so happy that Italian gibberish is back, bro. By Canon Express. Ooh. Oh my god, Luigi's gibberish is great too. We need to stitch the Gifton Islands back together. But I'm getting sidetracked. We want to go to the lighthouse on this island. Know where it is? Yeah, but you can't get there now. The gate across the path is shut. Oh, wow. I'm sure, like... I'm still kind of getting a feel for the new music, but I'm sure, like, you know, time will come. And I'm gonna be like listening to this song, or so some of these songs, and I'm gonna be like, "Oh hell yeah, that song is great." That doesn't look stable. You saying the lighthouse up on that dish-shaped rock? Ooh. Yes. If you really need to get there, ask Wilma, our chef. Now you's talking. Let's first let's find this Wilma. I'll explain the rest of the lighthouse. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, I'm just gonna have a fun... Have a fun! Look around! Yay, heart blocks! 
HP and BP fully restored, even though I'm not supposed to know what BP is yet. But whatever. Wait, hang on, what was that? View linked islands. Interesting. So you can check uh check that. Should I be checking the adventure log often? Just just for the fun little like images. After traveling by cannon, Mario and Luigi reach the drifting island Rumbla. What adventurers lie ahead? Head to the island's lighthouse. Speak with the locals to learn more about this unusual place. Wait, challenge? Wait, hang on, you see that right? Challenges? Oh my god, they got challenges in this game! Ooh, and they even... Oh my god, it... Is the duplex crown gonna be in this game? Oh... Oh, oh my god. You know damn right I'm gonna fucking 100% this game. Okay, that, that confirms that we have beans. And it looks like they use, um, the Bowser's Inside Story approach, where they're all green beans. Also, Super Candies? And Last Ditch Gloves. Defeat 300 enemies without equipping any ex wear gloves or accessories. Oh shit. 300 battles without gear? De collect 5,000 coins in battle. Defeat 999 enemies. Damn. Are there more challenges that are gonna lock throughout the game or what? Probably. Start battles with first strikes 30 times. Wait, Flying Star, that's literally the exact same name it has in Dream Team and Paper Jam, doesn't it? Well, maybe not Dream Team, but definitely Paper Jam. Okay, so, you guys might call me crazy, but I did 100% Paper Jam not too long ago, so all of the expert challenges in that game are, like, really fresh in my head. <laughs> I mean, getting 250 luckies is pretty cool, and of course they they lock a uh, you know a freaking accessory behind it. That's amazing. I'm ready to start sketches for my next big project. That recovery block gives me ideas. Just look at those shifting colors. A piece like that will restore the energy of whoever interacts with it. The style of the save block next to it is also very cool. Looks like it's designed to record things that happened. I'm feeling so inspired. I've always thought this was a magnificent statue. It's great for greeting visitors to Rumbla Island. Though we don't get many of those since the big split. Oh yeah, good job. Huh? Oh! You came from Ship Shape Island by cannon? An extreme way of travel, but fair enough. Welcome to Rumble Island. We're a big community of artists and crafters. Those giant statues are our proudest landmarks, though not everyone loves them. Be careful not to rile the troublemakers or their boss while you're visiting our island. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Okay, that's the same. Dude, I love that all of the characters have unique voices. It's just like the TTYD remake, where every single NPC has their own, like, talking noise. Made by the Rumble Island Chief Wilma, the future. I made this using my two children as models. The statue on the right is my son, Build It. <laughs> it has the spirit of energy and creativity. The statue on the left is of my daughter, Make It. <laughs> it has the spirit of harmony and imagination. I love these puns. These puns are never gonna get old, I swear. I mean, wasn't it, like, Superstar full of puns as well? Well, all the, all the, all the places have puns. You know, like, Dream Team, you know? All of the, uh, names in there are named after, like, waking up in the morning and going to bed and stuff. You know, like, Mush Rise Park, um, Mount Pajamaja, Wakeport. <laughs> Somnom Woods, you know? L lots of cool, inspired names. And then Paper Jam is just like, oh, S Sunbeam Plains, Doop Doop Dunes. That's where I really feel like, um, 
Dream Team and Superstar Saga excel in the naming department because they all follow a certain theme, which I love. And I can tell... I can tell that this game is going to do the exact same. Like, all of the names are named after, like, electricity and, like, sh like... I guess also in a way they're also named after, like, boats and stuff. You know, ship shape. So, yeah. I dedicate this to the happiness of Rumble and its people. That's all fuck. <laughs> ah, someone help! <laughs> What's that problem? Oh, they get their kicks from smashing our art. There's a tough looking customers. Yeah, let's let's go to the map. Alright, battle time. Alright, now we get to fight with both Mario and Luigi. When Mario and Luigi are together, you can select jump to have Mario and Luigi work as a team attack. Combined attacks might require more button presses, but they can do more damage. If either brother's KO'd or can't attack, he can't perform attack combos. Ooh, look at that! Luigi gets a turn as well. Use teamwork to defeat your enemies. Oh, but you, ha you still have to select the thing with B. Wow, these really are like bros attacks. When enemies attack, they'll target either Mario or Luigi. Yeah, okay. Okay, I'm getting the hang of it. To my knowledge, there's no way to turn off, um, like, the bros' actions, though. Also, the, um... The, um, what you call it? The br the attacks? Like, the attack timings seem, like, extremely generous. Like, I swear I pressed it, like, at least, like, ten frames before, and it still counts as an excellent. So... I mean, I'm, I'm cool with that. I mean, it's... If I'm... Maybe there will be a challenge battle somewhere, which, you know, I, I, I'm really hoping for that. <laughs> I would really love to see that. Hmm. Yay! Yay, you love that, Mario. Once you get enough experience to level up, your stats will go up. Mario and Luigi each have stats that grow faster than other brothers. Yeah, yeah, we get it. Well, I can't pick my stat level ups? Oh man. Oh man, they really are following the paper. They they're following Paper Jam a little too closely. I can't pick my level ups. Wow, you're strong. Thank you so much for helping us. I mean, I didn't mind that much that you can't pick stats in Paper Jam, but that's still, still a bummer. I feel like that's, they should totally have that. Okay, but what I find weird is that they made that change in Paper Jam, and then they reverted it back for the remakes, and now they're just saying, nah, who wants stat level ups? Who are you, anyway? Huh? A visitor from another world? I thought that might be it. Your face has a charming roundness we don't see much in Concordia. Say nothing of those gentle, fiendly groomed mustaches. Or finely, not fiendly. Ooh, the sight of you is lighting the fires of inspiration within me. If you want to get to the lighthouse, you'll need Wilma's permission. She's our chief. You deserve this in return. I hope you find a use for it. Hey! Mushroom. I love that. That's a good, that's a good, damn good looking mushroom model. To my knowledge, this is the first time that mushrooms have been 3D modeled in the series, right? Like maybe outside of like a few obscurities, I don't think mushrooms have ever been 3D before. Your items can be found from the menu. Okay, yeah. Aw, 
all. This music's nice. This area is a shortcut to the village, but rocks are blocking it right now. Wish we had a tool to break them. May I, maybe, maybe just a hunch, but I have a feeling the chief's gonna give us hammers. Wilma can point the way. Go through the village northeast of here, and then head west to reach her house. That was a close one. Thanks for saving me. The monsters here have been no end of trouble. Aw, oh, what a sad sight. Uh, what's this? Where are you two? <laughs> From Shape Shape? Huh, interesting. Why am I so down? Well, it's obvious. The connector flower withdrew into its bud. Connector flowers need connector to bloom, but as you can see, it's withered into a bud. All I want is to see it blossom. Once that happens, I can cross again. Ah. So, that's another world uh, building thing we need. Don't those blue bar things look like they're telling you to jump and grab them? Well, it turns out that's not enough. One person's momentum won't do it. Can we actually interact with these? Oh, look at that. That's pretty, that's pretty neat. I'm not sure, I, okay, now now that I'm, there's some platforming involved, I'm not sh actually sure how I feel about Luigi's movements being automated. Oh, that guy has got his back to us. Eh, <laughs> jumping and attacking preemptively. Okay, we're, it's lear we're learning about first strikes here. Ooh, damn. Well, you know damn well I've been taking advantage of first strikes. Dang, the, the, this damage is insane. Man, it's like every attack is a bro's attack. Oh wait, hang on, I, I need to know something for the next battle. I need to know if I can spam the emergency block. <laughs> Oh, he's doing the dance! Yes! He's doing the dance! <laughs> yeah, I'm so glad they brought that back. Okay, so the bros do love- they, they do dances on the level up still. Oh, hell yeah. Luigi still got the dance. He still got the, the poses and everything. Also... What if it's possible that you can choose your stat ups like every few levels, or maybe like when you rank up or something? That would be like a good in between, I think. Maybe. <laughs> That'd be cool. I, I wonder if they'll do that or not. Oh. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that to happen. Oh wait, I, I forgot the emergency card is R and not X and now. That's, that's gonna take some getting used to, because I'm so used to pressing R. Right, so I was gonna- I was gonna- I was gonna- Whoops. I was curious if I can spam it. Oh my god, yes you can! You can still spam it like I do! <laughs> Oh, let me do that again. Oh wait, never mind. Luigi, Luigi's oh, yeah. gonna kill it. Wait, hang on, I can still do it. <laughs> you can kind of still do it. That's that's amazing. I don't know why I got really addicted to doing that in Paper Jam, where I would just freaking um like spam the shit out of the emergency block. <laughs> Yeah, it's like really funny.
I like I like I like this music so far. This is some good music. I mean, it's the first area, so it's gotta start pretty simple. But yeah. Visitors here. How'd you get here when the islands are separated? Actually, who cares? We have new faces. Fresh appreciators of my work. The day is finally come. Behold! See these four magnificent statues? They're the founders of Rumbla Island. Or so the story goes at any rate. Now, note the precision and accuracy that went into modeling each sibling's chin. Each sibling is slightly different. I spent ages getting them just right. That's all I wanted to say. It was nice of you to listen. <laughs> He's getting fucking bored. Nothing like explaining your work to an eager audience. Can Luigi- wait, can Luigi get first strikes? Oh yeah, he can! Let's go! That's- that's great. I'm glad- I'm glad Luigi can still get first strikes. I mean, that's not something I should have to worry about, but, you know. I don't know, I kind of prefer the B button being used to, um, select actions with Luigi. I think that's a Superstar Thought Saga thing. And I'm kind of used to how it handles in that game, where you just press B to select an action, and you press the L button to go back. But in these modern games, you press A to, to confirm and B to go back. Which really throws me off. <laughs> oh, yeah! I know some people have said that they don't like that the like, bros actions are mandatory because they're kind of fearful that it will make the, um, game pacing take longer. But, I mean, if anything, it'll make it faster because your bros will kill enemies quicker. I think it's more of a problem when you're coming back later in the game and you're just killing enemies. You know, you just want to kill them with, like, one, like, simple attacks and stuff. Which, I guess I can understand that. This rock looks cracked. Good hit with the right tool might break it. Hold it! The gate is kept closed to ensure village's safety. Those awful monsters want to destroy our precious art. If you really want to enter the village, you'll need to team up. Although personally, I think it'd be better just to give up. Wow. <laughs> Real uh, motivational there. Okay, I see that block over there. Okay, so we can't use these right now. How the hell did I reach that block? Oh my god, Luigi's, Luigi's doing the thinking animation. Man, they really did a good job of like recreating all of the, like, bro animations in 3D. Hey, hey, what's up, Luigi? You getting any big ideas? Oh, oh yeah, I got Whoa. it. Alright, hear me out. Hey. Yeah! <laughs> Luigi's ideas. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Luigi's idea is to fit through gaps. Wow. Big brain moment for Luigi there. Oh yeah. Thanks to that bit of Luigi logic in the way for Luigi logic. Oh my god, I love that name. <laughs> it's actually called it. It's actually called Luigi logic. During your adventures, Luigi will sometimes suddenly make a leap of logic. If Luigi's focused on something, a glow will appear around him. Press L while it's visible, and Luigi will put his plan into action. <laughs> Luigi really just said, like, alright, I'm a big brain everything. 
Oh. Bro, I fucking love this game. This is the game this is game of the year right here. I don't fucking care. Well, I don't know where that came from, but keep doing it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, big brain. Man, I love the thing I love about these Mario and Luigi games is Luigi's like secretly like the smartest guy around. He's like secretly the, the like the biggest brain person ever. Wow, so you could just have Luigi do whatever the fuck you want. It's like, hey Luigi, go clean the dishes, press the L button. Hey Luigi, go uh go go uh steal weed from that homeless person, press the L button. <laughs> Hello, visitors. Good to see new faces on Rumble Island. Wait a sec. Visitors! Oh, wow. You came from Ship Shape to link our island? Great. It's been a while since I had anything to do as a greeter. Good luck with the island, Link. I'd love to welcome more visitors. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got a shop. Ugh, I don't feel like making anything. I need a new angle, new inspiration. Huh? I don't think we met before. I remember that facial hair. You got me so inspired that I'll tell you a little about this world. Anything you want to know about that? Uh, sure. This world used to be filled with energy called connector. Lighthouses throughout Concordia transmitted this connector. So if you're re reconnecting islands, then look for the lighthouses. The Unitree was a large tree that produced connector energy. It was a protector of this world right up until someone destroyed it. With it, it went the flow of connector from the tree to the lighthouses. The land split apart and became islands drifting around the ocean. Okay, so from what I'm getting at, connector seems to be like the electricity of this world. Lighthouses are like power plants, and connector are like wires that, you know, give everything uh, what do you call it? Electricity? Power? Basically? That seems to be the gist of this. Uh, what about Wilma? Wilma's our island's chief. She lives alone on the village outskirts. Her two kids were off on errands the, day, the other day at the land split apart. She puts up a good front, but she has to be missing her kids, right? Though I think she has someone else, but can't remember who. It's tough to be alone. Oh, there are chronic back problems. <laughs> it's tough being a mother. Feel free to ask me whatever. It gets old seeing the same faces every day. The Rumbling Dish is, si is sacred ground to the north of the island. It's incredible. Our ancestors made it to protect the lighthouse, and it works perfectly. It's a work of art that looks like a dish balanced precariously on a pillar. Uh, I hope the monsters don't destroy it. It's been too long since I had new customers. Welcome to the Rumblest Finest Item Shop. Alright, I mean, you got your typical items here. <gasps> Boo Biscuits! The best item in the game, the Boo Biscuit! <laughs> Alright, looks like, uh... Refreshing herbs return. Here status is like Trip, Dizzy, Burn, and Ice. Oh, that's a new ailment. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be buying that many items. Well, I guess I could buy a serum, why not? I don't- <laughs> three more Boo Biscuits. You know damn well I'm going to be buying Boo Biscuits. Especially if, um... Um, what am I trying to say? Fuck, I'm, 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 I'm drawing a blank here. Especially if there's enemy-related challenges where you have to dodge a certain amount, a certain amount of enemy attacks. Why? Whoa! Wait a minute. Are these the fucking pipes from uh? Is the those kind of, that kind of looks like the pipes from Partners in Time? Like the item, the pipe blocks. Oh hell yeah! We got warps now already. That's sick. We, yeah, we more more fast travel is always great. Don't walk fast travel to like midway through the game like Dream Team did. I fucking hated that. <laughs> uh, 
All right, what else we got? Voila, my latest piece entitled Weight of the World. One can truly engage in art by merely looking at it. You must go further, don't touch it, absorb it, study it, climb on it. You, yes, true art appreciation must be done up close and personal. Um, a house that I can't go in? Yeah, another day of boring rocks. Huh? I've never seen you before. Huh? You came here from another island? Ship Shape Island? Oh, yes! That rocks! You're the first guest we've had since the world split apart. Seems like you're looking out the ocean. Is there something interesting out there? Uh, just the opposite. This seems mostly boring. Hey, do you guys know about reefs? Reefs are those big hunks of rock you see in there in the ocean, yeah? Mmm, right, right. Concordia seeds. They have many rare reefs with strange shapes. Everyone on Rumble makes such fantastic objects. But for me, reefs with strange shapes made by nature, that's what I like. Hmm. Mmm, ah, reefs. Strong sentinels of the ocean. Fascinating figures, steering imagination. They really rock. Oh, sorry. My brain's full of images of fantastic reefs. Mmm. I'm always here looking for reefs. Folks have started calling me... It's a rock. It is a rock. Seriously? <laughs> nice hand you got there, yep. Um, so, I might want to go back to looking at the sea, maybe. Is there is there a pun here that I'm not getting? Oh, sure. Go right ahead. <laughs> back in the Luigi's hat you go. Yeet. Um, there's nothing I can do here? <gasps> what up? I got a hidden block. Hidden blocks are back, guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Luigi, Luigi noticed the, um, the frickin' vegetables over here. The great vegetables. Hey, I mean, Luigi's getting free money from me, man. Those things that look like turnips are plug radishes. I make coins by putting them sometimes, but it's hard work. Though you took a split up and pull them all no problem. Uh, I can't think of anything to make. This is way worse than not being able to do art right now. I gotta get off the island and get some new ideas. Rumbla Village Masterpiece 04. No, I'm not asleep. When you're tired and just about to drift off and someone asks, are you asleep? You'll probably answer, no, I'm not. It'd be easier to pretend to be asleep, so why do people say that they're not? <laughs> the drive for this piece was an attempt to answer that eternally vexing question. Oh, there was a shit ton of art that I missed or something. I don't know, I haven't seen any other signs. Rumble Island Exhibit 01. Rumble Head Moon. It's important to remind oneself of simple pleasures such as gazing at the moon. But when one, when one views it with a rumbla dish, the towering sacred piece of rumbla, the god of art smiles, wishing luck to all who can appreciate the simple things in life. P.S. Pay no attention to the fact that the title of this work is handwritten on a sticky note. This piece stands out as the best thing I've ever created. It's in the village square, which is quite an honor of a, for an artist. <clears throat> Sorry, no autographs. Rumble I Village Masterpiece 02, Blue Memory. One day I got the urge out of nowhere to secretly eat sweets from Wilma's house. When Wilma found out and scolded me, my face turned an interesting color. I heard it was a beautiful shade of blue. I tried to incorporate that into this piece. Okay, I'm, I'm, where's the third exhibit then? I was wondering if I'd ever get to greet a new customer. 
Welcome. Thanks for visiting the Rumble Island Gearporium. Alright, what do you got? Rundown boots, which... Don't worry, I already have that. Discount boots, which we'll have to upgrade, and dirt cheap wear. Yeah, dirt cheap, and I can't afford it, damn it. I bought- I, I spent all my money on boo biscuits! Man, what am I doing? Thank you for your business, let's hope it's see you again. People called Watanus used to- People called Watanus used to take care of the unitree. But now the unitree's been destroyed. Where are they now? Concordia was once divided into five distinct regions. Now the five regions are five seas and the islands are the lands are islands. This is the lush green sea, once known for its natural beauty. Oh wait, I think I found the other exhibit. Rumble of Village Masterpiece 05, Grandpa Bird. A bird on the run from some monsters escaped into my house. It looked like an old man, but it sang like an angel and became an island mascot. Sometimes it ate nasty bugs as it to repay us all for our hospitality. It's doing fine now. Postscript. Turns out he found a lady friend. Now I'm hard at work on Grandma Bird. I love making small art objects, but I'd like to make something big that'll surprise everyone. It'd be a way to connect them with our ancestors who made Rumble of Dish, you know? Is there another exhibit that I'm missing? Am I stupid? Uh, I'm just looking for signs. Oh, I think this is the one. The weight of the world. I shoulder a lot of burdens. Work, family, dreams. But if I think of them as burdens, my back aches and my face turns purple. It's better to think of those things as treasure. That's the message of this piece. Alright, we got another heart block. There we go. Wanna oh, know something about switches? If you had the right tool, you could hit it. Oh. Man, I wish I had a hammer. This drawbridge should go down if you hit that switch on the wall. But your fist alone won't do the job. You'll need something sturdier. Okay, we have to be getting hammers soon, then. Looks like we're gonna have another encounter with those buffoons. Stop, please! Stop ruining our art! Uh, give it a rest! Oh, I, th I think this is the chief. Better stand back! Things are about to get rough! Chief Wilma! If you say so. Aw, oh, shit. You punks are at it again, eh? Smashing up people's art, you ought to be ashamed. Dealing with your guff is bad for my blood pressure. You get your very own all expenses paid trip to Scoldsville. Ah! Ugh, all the times for my back to give out. Oh shit! Hey, don't ignore me when I'm giving you the business! Oh shit. He's got- he's got backup. He's got cohorts. Yeah, what makes you think ganging up makes you tough? Oh shit, Mario and Luigi, you're squaring up. Let's fuck him up! Guard arm. Gotcha, bitch. Yeah, get out of here. Guard. I probably need to jump on the actual, like, body, you know? There we go. Got it. Yeah, there you go. I keep pressing the freaking B button, just like Luigi's actions. It's gonna take some time to get used to. Boom. 
Got him. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Youch, guess my back can't take the strain these days. But I won't let a little pain. Uh, ow, ow. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah! Well now, I don't know what's gotten into you. What about those what about that toolbox? I suppose I'll have to get it later. Oh now I'll get it. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's mighty nice of you. I appreciate the help. My house is just up ahead. Can you take me that far? Sure thing, lady. See you there. Picking up objects. When you're close to something that can be picked up, press A, Mario, or L, Luigi. Why is Luigi L and why is Mario A? That's confusing, bro. What was B? Is B not good enough? When you're carrying something, you can put it down again by pressing A or L. Why L or A? Why A or L? Oh, yeah. what Pass? The what the hell? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. yeah, for some oh, reason... Yeah. Oh. Luigi can only pick up shit with L. That's so weird. That's a weird ass control scheme. Just leave the toolbox on that workbench there. I got it. Yeah. Oh yeah. Thanks. Say I didn't introduce myself, did I? I'm Will, my chief of the whole island. So, newcomers, huh? How'd you get here? Right, it all started when... Well now... I figured Concordia was gone for, for good when it broke apart. It's just, I wonder if you can make it... The path to Rumble Dish is dangerous. What's more, there might be more of those tough guys from before as well. There's a lighthouse on top of the rumblet dish, right? That's right. There's a lighthouse right on top of that wobbly rumblet dish. Oh, yeah! Ooh. I've opened the gate that leads to the rumblet dish. Oh, that looks like fun. Look at that water, too. Ah, that's right. I have a son, build it, and a daughter, make it. They're great at what they do, just like their mom. Build is a skilled glove crafter while make it's an expert accessories. But they haven't been home since. Well, not since Concordia broke up. I'm giving you samples of their work. Aren't they so talented? Yay! Build it gloves and make it bangle. Ah, am I worried? Of course I am. I'm their mom after all. But those two, they'll be okay. I need to protect the village. All I can do is hope they're safe. You'll feel better with that gear on. Alright, off with you now. Let's go. Yay, we got gear now. That's awesome. I thought, um, I thought she'd give us hammers, but in actuality, she gave us, um, accessories. Really goes against the expectations, huh? Oh, okay. It seems like, um, this hasn't changed. Any new challenges that unlocked? Uh. Get 30 excellence with the jump attack combo. Okay, based. I can totally do that. Any other new ones? Deal a thousand damage or more with one attack. Oh, yes! They brought that back too. Doom Dodger. Win a hundred battles in a row without getting a game over. 
Oh, that's an interesting one. I don't think that's ever been in the game before. Yeah, I'll definitely be going over, um, I'll definitely be going over, um, all of the expert challenges. And I'm probably going to document, like, what the reward is for getting all the challenges. If it is the duplex crown again, I, I wouldn't, I honestly wouldn't mind, because the duplex crown's fucking awesome. Anyways. Woohoo! No gear? Increase power by 5. Increase damage done with the first strike by 15%. Alright. Cool. I mean, yeah, we can only equip one accessory at a time right now. Yeah. Um, I don't, I don't think I could do anything with that yet. You gotta get to the rumbling dish. It's sacred ground around here. Did you pack a toothbrush? Oh, I'm sure you did. Take care now. Well, I think we know who Mom of the Year is going to. If you're hungry, come to my house. Well, <laughs> she's not just a mum to her kids, but she's a mum to the whole island. Oh my god, there's green and red coins, Mario. Hmm. <laughs> Luigi's big braining again. Yo, we're getting so much moony, dude. Oh shit. Oh, this is fun. I love these music note things. Yay! I got a present. Dirt cheapware. Wait, did I just get one of those for free? Yeah, I think that was one of the um, gears I could find at the shop. That's pretty dope, honestly. Wow, <laughs> wow what the hell is that? Oh, Luigi! Luigi, Him. stop being dumb! Oh, okay, my bad. Oh, yeah. Why the fuck- why the fuck is Zeppi asking for the- the- the frickin' encryption keys for the Switch? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. oh. You can't do that here. What do you mean you can't? Hey, hey, you can't take that! That's an offering for the Rambla dish, our sacred ground! If you're taking it anywhere, take it to the offering dish. That's where it belongs, anyway. Well, you want to tell me how to do that? Oh, if you're here, then Willem must have sent to you. The sacred rumble dish? It's right up there on that plateau. <laughs> Luigi's frickin' hopping up and down with that. Now those no-good monsters move their offerings around. Until we get them back, the road to our sacred ground is closed. No good monsters, eh? You mean the ones that that lady from that after that lady from before? She was worried they might be hanging around here too, as I recall. Let's look around for the offerings and put them back where they belong. I mean, you can't do that here. Oh yeah. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Well, I can, I can, I can put it. I can, I can plant it. There we go. Ooh, what's that block? Man. Hmm? 
Oh, it's a turn block. Oh. Is Luigi oh. gonna have another big brain moment? Huh. <laughs> Having another big brain moment. God damn it. He doesn't know where he fucking put his switch encryption keys. That's so stupid. <laughs> eh? You think we got time to play on a seesaw? Huh. Oh, if Luigi gets on one okay. side. Mario. Mario, come on. Yeah, let's do it. Well, hang on. Let me talk to these people first. Can you tell the green guy to do something with L? Do you, even pre do you ever press L again to call him back to your side? Sorry you've been doing that already, I wanted to mention it. Oh. Oh. That seesaw looking thing was created by people long ago. It's to stop monsters from reaching the lighthouse on the Rumbla dish. I guess Luigi can like shift the weight of the of the balance. Oh, yeah. All right, how, how do I how do I eat that up there? Oh, I don't. <laughs> you just put it in there. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. That's cool. So you thought of a way to, of using the seesaw with one person as a weight. I wonder if two people could cooperate and use the seesaw to get that block. If you rotate the seesaw, you should be able to find a way to that block somehow. But I wonder how you could use that to get to that spot. It's high up there, so... So isn't it? It'd be great if you could jump on the seesaw and send one of you flying. I don't think I can get up there. I don't think I can get up there until I get, like, the hammer ability or something. <laughs> Whoops. I'm just kind of goofing around, don't mind me. <laughs> Got an enemy. These guys are gonna be pretty easy now. <laughs> I can still do the fucking dab. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Woohoo! Woohoo! Got him. But you can get lucky is when you counter now? If I'm not mistaken, I don't think you could do that before. So that's a pretty cool new feature. Oh, yeah. yeah, I'm pretty sure you don't get Lockies with counters in the previous games. I think that's new. I mean, I've played enough Mario and Luigi to know if that's if that's new to this game or not. We got a block. Hmm. Only eight more to go. Well, wow, look at that. I find it interesting that, um... 
what I'm trying to say. I, I don't know if these are all the challenges or not. Hard to say. This just doesn't feel like a lot, you know? How many like how many challenges are there? 8, 16, 24. There's 29 challenges. I, there has to be more than 29 challenges. That doesn't seem right. Okay, that doesn't update as much as I thought it did. <laughs> the stone statues around here look pretty heavy. Imagine jumping onto a seesaw while carrying one. What do you think would happen to the other end? Boing. Anything on will probably get launched into orbit. I kind of like to see that happen someday, actually. CD. Seed guy. Let's go. Man, excellence are just easier to get than ever, I swear. Hey, nice. We got a counter. I keep doing it. I keep freaking pressing B. I wonder if I'll, I wonder if that's just gonna be something I mess up like the entire game. I just keep pressing B to try and do Luigi's action, but I end up not doing anything. Oh, yeah. Yay! Level up. It's weird that Mario doesn't have a dance, but Luigi does. That seems really strange. Okay, he kind of does. He has, like, the thing where he takes off the hat. <laughs> eh, and Mar Mario's dance kind of kind of weak in this one, honestly, though. He doesn't even have a dance. That guy who was making, like, the ranking of all the Mario and Luigi dances? <laughs> He's gonna put that one pretty low, I bet. Oh, you know what I should do? I, should, I, I, I need to pay attention to, like, the bros' dances in battle. I haven't done that yet. I'm no one special, just a painter, sculptor, and devoted husband. But my wife and I had a spec, so I've been spending my time here. One of my old pieces around here, do what you will with it. Wonder if that's uh wonder if that's like Wilma's ex-husband or something. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, so what would happen if I jump on this? Oh man. I don't know if I didn't, I don't know if I jumped high enough or what. Is it possible to have like Luigi hit this block or what? Oh yeah. Yeah. All right, let's jump. Whoop. No, we can't make that. We gotta go. We gotta. We gotta go somewhere else. I think we need to grab that stone up there. Oh yeah. Alright, now just stay there, Luigi. Whoop. Oh yeah, Luigi. Yeah, I got it. I got the stone. The stone statues around here look pretty heavy. Oh. I think I already read that. We got more puzzles. Oh yeah. Oh. Okay, so what I think I need to do here. Put that down. Hit this. And then grab this. Oh, yeah. And then I can can I can I just put this down or do I have to land on it? Oh shit! <laughs> Wait, you get the fuck down here! Oh, I was wondering who had my statue. Oh yeah. 
Luigi's just gone, bro. <laughs> Dang, poor Luigi, bro. <coughs> yeah, I got it. Hey, there we go. I kind of forgot. I, I need to hold it, and then Mario has to put it down. Which is really weird, I don't know why. Mm. Man, this tea is so good. So, I, um... So I was drinking tea a few days ago, and the tea was tasting kind of funny, right? And I was like, why the fuck does my Earl Grey taste so fucking bad? And then I looked at the milk. And the milk was like a day past the expiration date. <laughs> and I was like, oh, that's why it tastes like shit. So I went to go buy more milk, and uh, yeah, now my tea tastes good again. So, uh, yeah, I can safely say I know what expired milk tastes like now. It tastes fucking bad. It, ta it has a weird aftertaste. It's like kind of like sweet, but weird. I don't know how to describe it. But it's not good, I can tell you that. Oh, you guys, you return the offerings back to where they belong. Thank you. Now the path to the sacred ground, the rumble dish is... open? Oh, here's where we get to use the fun new abilities. Whoa, this cliff is hard to climb. Well, at least by myself, it's impossible. Time to square it up! Oh shit, we're getting ambushed. This is a new type of battle or something? No, there's just four of these guys. I thought there was- I thought it was gonna be like, um... I thought it was gonna be like where where Mario and Luigi are in the middle and like they're facing off against enemies from both sides. That'd be fucking awesome, actually. Uh, it'd be kind of like um, I think that happens in FF7. I could be wrong. That would be pretty dope, though. Guy. All over Luigi today, huh? Yeah, I got a crit. I got a crit with my freaking guard, dude. God damn, I did it again, bro. Fuck, I need to stop. I need to get better at that. See, that's why I hate the fact that, um... You press A to confirm with Luigi's actions, because I'm ready to press whatever button I'm pressing. But since it's not B, it fucks me up. I can, I'm so glad they kept that. It's such a stupid thing that only I do, but it's it, it is it's pretty amazing, honestly. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, here we go. Oh, yeah. oh shit! I didn't pay attention to the dances. <laughs> I love- I lo also love that the brothers, like, clap for each other. That's something that's not in the original. Or, well, <laughs> the other games, I should say. So that's- that's a nice detail, I'd say. So yeah, HP, BP, POW, Defense Speed, and Stash are still here. And the way he's got a shit ton of Stash. Like he usually does. <laughs> Any new challenges that opened up? Counter enemies, win 100 battles while taking damage. We're gonna get that pretty soon. Use items in battles 20 times. Oh yeah, I might have to do that at some point. Hmm. 
I wonder what the last ditch gloves are. See, the thing is, I can't look up what these items do because, you know, this game's brand new. So, yeah, here we go. Yay, we did it. Yay, they got five coins. Let's go. Oh, what do we do here? Oh, I don't know, Mario. It looks pretty complicated. Boing. Oh, we got a big ass key. Ah, oh, yeah, let's go. Big brain moment. Did that do anything? Oh shit. Oh, what the fuck, Luigi? What the hell is happening here? You guys better get the hell out of there. <laughs> yeah! Oh man, this, this soundtrack is so good so far. It's very... It's very, it very, it sounds very orchestrated, which I love. I love the, I love the um the usage of like jazz, you know. The jazz is like really good. It is the connector plug. Remember what Connie told you about the unitry and the connector? Yes. Wow, you got a good memory. Saves me from having to repeat it. There was these connector plugs that spread connector everywhere. The plugs linked the unitry up with the other spots around the world. That's why we need to connect this plug to ship shape and restore the flow of the connector. You need to get that connector from the tree on ship shape here to Rumbler Island. How the fuck are we gonna do that? Look alive, man, Luigi. Let's yoink this plug. We have to carry it all the way there. Yes! Oh. <laughs> okay, that's way cooler than I thought it was gonna be. Damn, that goes hard. Ooh. Look at us already restoring an island. Yeah, and it restores all the, like, flowers. Everything's alive again. Yeah, we did it! Look at that little happy dance that they just did. You connected Rumble Island! Oh yeah, the tree is definitely improving, isn't it? No hammers quite yet, but that's okay. I'm I'm having fun. <laughs> Amazing. So that's an island like in action, eh? <laughs> Welcome back. I see you linked Rumbler Island up with Ship Shape. That's great. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Wow, two islands linked up to each other. Who'd have thought? This place is so different with Rumble Island. From one thing, it's got a huge tree. I do appreciate a good change of scenery. Are those people from Rumble Island? 
You know, what's going on with that pipe? Ooh, blue pipe. Maybe it can use, be used for traveling back and forth between islands. Oh, dude, is Ship Shape Island gonna get, like, more populated the more we go through the game? That sounds awesome. We found one drifted island and linked it back up with Ship Shape. Now let's do the rest. All you gotta do is go to an island, head to its lighthouse, and yoink out the connector plug. You might have to resolve some island problems sometimes, but you seem pretty good at that. Hey, if you can connect them all, the world will be whole again. Hey, <laughs> yeah! Blink us away! Let's go find the other drifting islands! We can also stop by Rumble Island to see what people think of, people think of it now. After linking islands, when you link other islands to ship shape, all sorts of things can happen on the linked island. For example, connector flowers bloom to open the way to places you couldn't get to before. Or characters might have moved between islands. Or just about anything else. Connector spirits called sprite bulbs are returning to the islands you've connected. Look for glowing bunches of sprite bulbs and try to capture these shining spirits. You can take the pipe on Ship Shape Island to travel to linked islands. Try revisiting linked islands every now and then. Oh yeah, that sounds like fun, honestly. It's very- it's uh, sparking the Metroidvania in me. Could this be? Oh, just in time. Take a look at this. This is a sprite bowl. I haven't seen one of these in a while. It's a sprite that contains connector energy. Hmm. The sprite bowl is always full of an energy called Luminade. We should collect all we can. I mean, why not, right? I'll say, the sprite bulbs are pretty speedy. Shouldn't be a problem for you guys. Maybe try some Luigi logic, too. Oh, yeah. If you want to collect sprite bulbs, you try going to linked islands. Sprite bulbs should have come out from hiding when the island link happened. Yes! <laughs> Pull on their nest with A and sprite bulbs will fly, fly out and float around. Chase after them with left so they can try to catch them. If you press Luigi, or press L, Luigi will help out as well. They're converted into an energy called Luminate, which will be useful later. I'll keep all the sprite bulbs you collected inside of me. I'm like a flying storage room. But don't go thinking of me as a piggy bank. Can't stand that. I wonder if there's a use for the sprite bulbs we collect. Maybe we can make something out of him. Eh, I'll put that one on the back banner. Well, let's take it. Come on, Linguini, you got this. Oh, we got one. I'd love to see even more people on Ship Shape. With all the space we have here, I hope we find a way to use it well. I bet having some shops in this area would liven things up a bit. Ooh, are they gonna set up a shop here? Did that shout come from the beach? I mean, I would like to get that present. I mean, I could go there, or... <laughs> can go back to the island. Yeah, we're level 3 already. Let's, let's ignore our responsibilities and backtrack. Oh, nice. Glad we have a, um... Oh, there's ten of them. We got a little map screen, that's fun. So where are we, anyway? Oh. We were near the start. Oh wow, that's a lot. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah! Hey, looky! Did you two see there's a sprite bulb nest over here? They have connector. There were more before the big split. If the two you split up, I bet you could catch lots. Boing. Oh. Oh, yeah. 
With the island link to ship shape, we have some connector back. Which means the sprite bulbs little connector fairies will be back too. Those shiny things are sprite bulb nests, if you find one pull on it. I'm sure any sprite bulbs you gather will come in handy someday. If you find them snatching up, my hunches are always working out, you see? Oh, it's you. The lighthouse is back on. We're all ecstatic that the connector's flowing through the island again. With the connector flowers in bloom, so many paths have been restored. Yeah, let's uh let's have a little look around, you know. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's a great day. The connector energy came back to the island. The flowers bloomed and the sprite bulbs went back to their nests. This is how the island should be. I'm so happy it's back to normal. We can get a 10 coin. All right, let's get some more. Let's get some more of those fairies. All right, we got so many of those connectors now. Oh, and the the green pipes are still there. After we got rec rec reconnected with ship shape, the connector flowers bloomed again. If I remember right, there's only there's one a little ways from the east of here. Well, I can't get there. Dang it. I gotta go the long way around. Oh, I never went over here. Is it the classic? You can still do that. I can't believe how synced you guys are with the blue bars. Let me guess, you're stuntmen from a traveling circus troupe? I never looked around here. I wonder if there's going to be diggable bean spots later on. How funny would that be? Did I ever go over here? Oh, there's a seedling here. Or, sorry, seedles, not seedlings. I think seedlings are a completely different Mario enemy. Yeah, jump combo expert. Nut. Yo, that was literally the exact item noise from uh, the other games, I'm pretty sure. If you can hit the challenge conditions, you'll get a challenge clear, which will earn you a title and a reward. Well, that's good. Ooh, and he also got a present. Rumbla Stone. The hell is a rumble stone? Are those like enemy item drops or something? Let me see. Uh, can be used as. Wait, there's materials in this game? No fucking way, that's actually insane. I realized something about myself. I seem to like talking about art more than I actually enjoy creating it. It's certainly a sobering thought, and it leaves me wondering, now what? The bro's all sobered up. Come on, Linguini, got- land on it. Land his ass. Let's a go! Ooh, more rumble stones. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you know what I keep forgetting to do, guys? I keep forgetting to look at the bros dances. Hang on, my, my god, I'm gonna never remember to do this at this point. Yeah. Hopefully I remember like at least by the end of the episode. Can I not get in there? I don't think we can explore that area until we get the, the hammers. We will told me it's fine to keep the gate open, but I'll stay at my post for the good of us all. Oh yeah, so we have these flowers now that weren't open before. One up, and me! Oh yeah! 
Yeah, why, don't let Luigi do all the work. Pull up some of yourself. That'll speed it up. We definitely need to come back and smash up these boxes later as well. The second I get the, um, the hammer, I'm doing that. <laughs> you linked the islands. I wasn't sure you could actually do it. Think of all the visitors we'll get. I heard you're li we linked back up to ship shape. Might go check it out. I really lighthouse is a special place where the lighthouse is. Link in the islands won't be easy, but I think you can do it. Um, how actually, out of curiosity, how much do materials sell for? Ten? Uh, that's not too much. I'm just looking around to keep an eye out. Hmm? You guys again? Right now I'm looking for a reef with a rare shape. I'm concentrating really hard right now, so talk to you later. Mm. My art is looking even nicer with the island connected. At least they make these spots really easy to notice. Dang, Luigi runs faster than me. <laughs> Oh! 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 That's a fun button to spam. <laughs> the lighthouse tur turning on gave me a cool new idea, but then I forgot I could write it down. Am I not going to any of these houses? That's too bad. Also. If I'm not mistaken, I think when we get the, um, the hammers later, I think if I'm not mistaken, the hammers will be mapped to the X and Y buttons. Although, I'm not too sure about that yet. Oh, how much money do I have now? I could probably buy a dirt cheap wear now, I think. Or I could just get discount boots. Oh, thank god for this. Yeah, equip it to Luigi. <laughs> I'm gonna do the silly thing that I do where I just make Luigi, like, stupidly OP for no reason. Just think about how many visitors will see my piece now that they can visit. Might even be time for me to start practicing my autograph. Okay. I mean, this game has auto-save, so... It won't matter too much. You wanna go this way? Oh. Yes! Cause Willa says you can't. Come back later, okay? Oh man, really? Then after we became so buddy-buddy with her earlier. More details of the piece are available on the placard. I've heard of strange creatures out there that look like plug radishes. Folks say they've been around on Concordia for a long, long time. We have dreamed of reconnecting with the other islands and their people. I made a quick trip to ship shape since the islands are linked now. Was that a child by the big tree of Watanist? She's far too young. Alright, well, let's go back. I got what I wanted. Man, they got, like, all kinds of fast travel now, which is great. I don't know if there's anything else I missed. I mean, there's one thing I can't get right now. Like, a couple things I can't get. Yeah, so... A lot of this is blocked off until later. But I find it funny that in settings, the only thing you can turn off is rumble. <laughs> Anything new in Snoutlet School? Oh yeah, I mean, these are mostly just things we've seen already. I got like half of them, that's good enough, I think. I'm sure any sprite bowls you gather will come in handy someday. Oh, I already read that. Alright, let's take the blue pipe. Do you want to take the red pipe or the blue pipe? Alright, let's head back. 
<laughs> Let's actually head to the be beach and like make some progress. Alright, well, let's go, let's go check out the beach then, see what's over there. Look at Luigi being all big brain and shit. That's like the only thing crossing my mind. <laughs> Alright, so... I took a quick bathroom break. I mean, for you guys, it'll feel like nothing, but I went to go take a dump, get me, uh, some drink, and, uh, we're gonna go to the beach now. And I really wish I could get that rare present. I don't know what's in that present. Yeah, that's stuck really good. How are you gonna get it open? What's going on? And where did this capsule come from? Must have washed the shore. Also, every time this fucking song starts up, I keep thinking it's gonna be the frickin' Mr. Rossetti theme, but it's not. <laughs> like, it has, like, the first few notes of the Mr. Rossetti theme, but it ends up then turning into a different song. I'm like, huh, Mr. Rossetti? Oh, never mind. Well, yeah, that's, it's kind of weird. Libio! <laughs> Is someone inside? We need to help them. We tried, but it's sealed shut. Hey Mario, Luigi, you guys want to do something here? Yeah. Yeah. Fuck up that capsule! Help the poor castaway, Mario. Oh. oh, hang on, I got this. Whoa, there, Luigi. Nobody asked you to headbutt the thing. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Look at that guy's face. Ugh, what did I just say, man? Nothing's working, Mario. Oh, this sucks, Luigi. I don't think this is working. We might not have the right tool for the job. Hmm? You think you could get it open with a hammer? Oh yeah. Yeah, we use hammers all the time. Someone here needed a hammer? Hey there. Thought I'd visit now that that's an option. Hello. Huh. Nice place. It's too bad my kids aren't here to see it. But I haven't seen either of them since the world fell apart. Oh, that's right. You gave us some gear before. You said your kids made it. What were their names? Bill didn't make it. Oh, you're gonna find them for me? No fooling? Oh, yeah. yeah! Ain't that something? Well, then listen up. Last time I saw Billy, he was heading the rainforest to scrounge materials. <laughs> rainforest. The boy's quite a gifted glove maker. That was right about the time Make It went to the Twist and Sprout. The girl always had a knack for making accessories. But either one of them could make you a habit, no problem. If you see him, tell him I miss him, and tell him to hurry home. So, we could get help at either Rainforest or Twisty, but how do we find those islands? Ooh, over here! What the? This is an ocean map. It'll help you find islands. Bro just had a map in there that whole time. You got the ocean map. You gotta, you gotta say it like that. Ocean map. Yay, we have a map now. Let's go. Oh, it actually wants me to press minus. Is this where we are? Ship Shape Island? Right, well, I guess... I can't see right now. So you're if the islands are being carried out on the currents. To get any of them, you need to set a course for a new ocean current. Um, does it matter which one I go to? It's like the current you haven't sailed in yet. Um, how? Oh, this? Oh, like this one. 
So, for now, just pick any current we can reach. Switching between currents is a breeze. Hmm. When you approach the Drifting Island, launch yourself there with a big cannon. <laughs> Freaking burps again. We should have no trouble finding islands now that we have an ocean map. Let's search for the Drifting Islands where Build and Make It are. Those kids can't have gone far. Ship Ship Islands are ticket to tracking them down. If you need to get back to Rumble Island, that pipe will take you there. That's the way I got here. Gotta say, it's pretty useful. The folks there might know something about Build and Make It, too. Those kids are my pride and joy. Whatever it takes, just get me out! It's so dark in here. Okay. Mario and Luigi can use the ocean map to travel the currents with Ship Shape Island to find new islands. Press Mice to open the ocean map, adjust your field view. Yeah, yeah. On your way to the new island, you can visit other islands you've linked, battle enemies, or make any other preparations that you'd like for the future. Or next adventure, rather. Use Ship Shape Island to head for currents you haven't visited and find drifting islands. Each island will have enemies to battle and people to meet. Pull out the connector plug on Drifting Island, Lighthouses, and then link to Shipshape Island. Link all the islands and con restore Concordia to normal. That's a fun objective, honestly. So is it- it's actually like- it's actually moving right now. That's pretty dope. Let me out of here! Willis kids should have no problem making you a hammer that'll break open that capsule. I wonder if he did something bad to be forced into that capsule. We have to free whoever's trapped in that capsule. Mario Luigi, please help. Build it who went to rainforest. Okay, that, that's the same. <laughs> Hang on, do I need to, um... Do I... Ahem. Do I need to make my way over to the... The launcher, or what? I don't know, I'm trying here. <laughs> I'm not doing a very good job at it. Okay, let's make a save, then. Uh, oh yeah, the cannon is up here. I'll talk to the, uh, inhabitants later. I just think right now I want to get to the next island. So, you can do these in any order, then, looks like. You have a bit of, uh, option. We gotta find Builder to make it to crack that capsule open. Build it somewhere on Rainforce, where it make it on Twisty. One of them's gonna make us hammers. Doesn't matter which. But it does matter if you want them to make their specialty thing for you. Ask Wilma for the lowdown on that. Well, we already know. There's a choice to make. Build it or make it. Each can craft different items for you. The story might change based on who you decide to seek out first. Oh, that's kind of cool. Well, let's see. When is the, uh... When is it gonna come into view, anyway? Aw, oh, fuck. I, m I messed up. Do I have to wait for the frickin', like... Do I have to wait for it to frickin' come back into view now? Oh, no. <laughs> That's not good. There's no way to speed this up, is there? I mean, at this point, I'll just go to where a frickin' island is closest. So, uh, yeah, I guess I'll meet you back when the ship is in view of an island. Okay, I found, um, this island. I think we're gonna go here next. It should be in view now. Rainforest Island, yeah, let's go. Can I just go there right now? Mm -hmm. oh, 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 yeah, let's go. 
I mean, I, I just figured I'll go to whichever one is closest. And this one happened to be closer, so let's go there. Oh, no! Oh, well, he almost had it. You get in better, Luigi. Oh, sh man, my head hurts. Ooh, I love the vibes of this place. I don't, think we've ever, I don't think we've ever seen a rainforest in a Mario and Luigi game before, so that's pretty cool. Alright, well, anyways guys, I kind of want to go make some lunch, so I think this is a pretty good place to end off the first episode of Brothership. Um, I'm also going to check on the recording and see if it even came out correctly, but yeah. Um... There, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go make lunch, and then I'm going to be back with another episode. So, as always, guys, make sure to like and subscribe to me on YouTube and Twitch. And, um, yeah, I'm excited to say this will be my next series on the channel. So, yeah, I'll um, see everybody then. Take care.